Hey, it's Paul from HowToNetwork.com. I've been busy writing, so I haven't done a video for a few days. As you know, unless you've been living in a cave, there's a uh, virus spreading all around uh, planet Earth, and many of us have been recommended to um, self-quarantine. So uh, the recommendation on average is 14 days, depending on which country you live in. So some people are doing this voluntarily and others um, because you've fallen ill. So um, I think every cloud has a silver lining. And for most of us, we'll just feel a little bit poorly and um, hopefully be able to carry on with our, our normal days. So I wanted to recommend something you can do productively in um, two weeks. So, um, as always, it's going to be passing a, a valuable certification, which is going to help your career, help you uh, get into IT or get promoted and make more money. And maybe do some freelancing if you're interested. So, um, here are a few ideas for you to do some um, certs, which ones I think you should consider. If you've never heard of me, I've written uh, quite a few IT books on certifications. A couple of these are actually... Um, you can't take any more of the Cisco design, but uh, well worth reading still. So that's a bit about me and my website's howtonetwork.com, 101labs.net, in60days.com. If um, you want to hear more, I do videos on your IT career certification and uh, how to do uh, freelancing, either full time or part time. You please uh, hit the subscribe and uh, the button and the bell. And I've just got one more video. I've forgotten to mention this before, which I should have. But um, I've I got a lot of freebies, webinars, ebooks, and loads of goodies, which I think you'll find really useful. So if you go to howtonetwork.com and on the top menu, you'll see uh, free training. If you click on that, I'll basically explain what you'll get. There's a nearly a 300 page ebook on your best study tips. How to study like a pro webinar, how to land your first IT job is an hour's webinar, myths about IT freelancing, one hour's webinar, all free, um, how to perform well in your exams, pretty handy, 30 minute webinar, how to get motivated, uh, over an hour's webinar, uh, just put your email in the um, box at the bottom, click submit and check your junk folder obviously because it could always land in there. So there's loads of goodies. Uh, first one is uh, Linux. Linux used to be nice to have. I'm, I'm telling you now it's a must have no matter what you're doing in IT because um, a huge amount of corporate networks are running almost all Linux now and um, you must have it. And it's also uh, covered in most IT certification exams. So um, you learn how to use the command line. This is the Linux LPI essentials, by the way. You can Google that term. Create, move and delete files, some basic scripting, some basic security. So you can tick that box on your resume that you know some security. File permissions, hardware. Uh, these are the kind of jobs you would look for. You don't just have to be, so what's this? A coder, admin. And then obviously the engineer, which is the hands-on um, security Microsoft networking. You can use a VM and download all our courses. We um, use that as the uh, operating system, the distribution. So that's free to use. Go to, um, I've written over it now, sorry, lpi.org. And you can see more about that. Cloud is obviously here. Uh, we're all using the cloud. And many people aren't aware of um, the applications they're using, for example, their email, uh, storage, that kind of stuff, but it's all running off the cloud. Uh, a couple to look at, seriously consider, is the Microsoft, the Foundations, Azure Foundations, which is really cloud networking and a bit about Azure, and the CompTIA Cloud Essentials. Probably, if I'm honest, do both because there's around, I think, check the syllabus there's around 70% crossover so you've almost done the other one already so you look at the cloud models software as a service infrastructure platform as a service uh, why pros and cons it's not for everyone obviously uh, what, what could your company migrate what systems or some none impacts and risks so this lets you have a conversation with um, other engineers your boss or customers 
as to um, you know how the cloud works and you can have an intelligent conversation um, there's a whole bunch I think at the moment Amazon are pretty much number one closely followed by number two as market leader number three is Google and obviously um, vendor neutral is CompTIA so probably I'd look at doing the CompTIA and then one of the um, vendors personally Juniper uh, so there's been big changes with Cisco as you know now there's no specializations or severely restricted I recommend um, we you look at the Juniper they're really easy to study there's free online VRACs alternative to Cisco exams as well and um, they're a um, big name in the um, networking market I didn't um, render these slides sorry these should all be popping in the Microsoft MTA is probably one of my favorite exams it's suitable for beginners if you're just stressed and you don't have much time but you still want to get somewhere with your career uh, go for the MTA there's uh, quite a few tracks which I'll show you in a minute there's the OS which is Windows 10 uh, that will never change from what I hear Windows 10 won't there won't be a Windows 11 12 it'll just be um, improved on uh, server is currently working off server 2016 by the way you can run these in a VM with free trials uh, there's a security database there's a whole bunch they're cheap to take I think I think they're about $100 or maybe slightly less but check that so oh and the other thing is they last for life you'd have to retake them every three years so these are the MTAs here the infrastructure track the database track which is only one exam and then the development which is software developments uh, .NET all this kind of stuff so um, we've got these on the website uh, the server networking you can just do the CompTIA and then uh, pass that also and also database Wireshark is one of my favorite uh, certs and I, I've got it on my I've got other videos but it's a must-have um, I recommend uh, if you want to be a network engineer for security and I'll show you in a minute you basically sniff traffic going across the wire or um, wireless you also can um, capture wireless uh, traffic uh, you baseline the network so you find out at um, one o'clock two o'clock three o'clock four o'clock etc what are the patterns on your traffic and if there's any unusual activity and you can also provision for expanding the network troubleshoot problems which is the most probably the most important thing your customers will probably ask you to um, analyze uh, captures from um, sniffer uh, you can use it use um, use it for security find hacking attempts and it's free to download so the cert is the Wireshark certified network analyst and this is one of my things I reckon you can do in 14 days um, so it looks like we've we got to the end here all of the courses I mentioned funnily enough are on um, howtonetwork.com there's a code on the next slide uh, some of them are really easy you could probably do in around three days like the MTA operating systems others you would uh, prov um, provision for the 14 days so these are all the vendors and uh, streams you can choose from uh, feel free to browse around the website and um, there's a help desk if you want to log a ticket and ask a question if you're watching the YouTube videos have a look at the site and then come to this special URL howtonetwork.com forward slash YouTube you get uh, to join for a dollar for 30 days access then it um, goes to twenty dollars a month cancel any time by logging into your account there's probably more than 25 courses I think there's more than 30 now practice exams we've got live Cisco racks 24 7 free to all members experts are on the forum to help you do some career training and exam strategy support so that's pretty much it um, I hope you're all keeping well. I hope your family are all well. That's the most important thing, remember. And um, this too will pass. So um, I'll see you on the next video.